What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. What's going on, folks? You know, as always, Mr. Wonderful was definitely in the building, so whether you like it or not, there's only two things you can do about it. Like it and nothing. So let's go in. Today I'm going to talk about something. I'm not going to talk about any type of... Well, you should be aware of this, but I'm not, going to, I'm not really going to talk about anything that's real, you know, sensitive. Well, it's going to be sensitive, because, but I'm not going to talk about, like, something worldly or anything. I'm going to talk about you schmucks and your, uh, when you get your uh, opinions and beliefs killed by facts. That's what I'll talk about. Like, I see this all the time happen where... Let me adjust this real quick. Where somebody will come in with their beliefs and opinions that they had forever, and all of a sudden they collect, they come on the internet, and all of a sudden they get their that crushed, and all of a sudden they won't take it personal. They want to do whatever. And like I try to tell people, it's it happens to everybody. You're not the only one. There's certain beliefs that you have that you didn't think that you know that you thought you were right. That you met somebody or a group of somebody's that convinced you, man, you're fucked up, so, and a lot of people do this, like, if I go on, like, groups, of, like, Facebook groups are the worst ones, because a lot of these people come in there, and, and I'm going to explain to you the type of people these are, these are the type of people, like, hey, they're usually probably, like, a single parent type deal, not all the time, but, uh, or, and B, they, but they're, they're the type of person, they're like, you know, they start arguing, you just give them their way just to shut them up, They've been placated all their life to the point where everybody says, "Well, you know how so and so is." They've been placated their whole life, so they think when they come on the internet, they can run their mouth and pop off like they do. But then when you get at them, all of a sudden they, "Oh, you're just jealous. You're just jealous," and they, they, they make up stupid bullshit. This has happened to me on numerous times where, like, someone was trying to get at me, you get at my throat, and like, I'll take your purse. And if you're trying to get at my throat, I'm chopping your fucking head off. And what I did is I call, I got the hack, I use facts, and I use truth to get them. And they're like, well, that's just not the way it should be. Look, man, I don't, look, I may not agree with something, but if that's how it is, that's how it is. And then, they, like I said, I, they get all personal, oh, you're just jealous, you're stalking me. I'm like, hold up. How do we go from we were having a nice little conversation slash debate, now all of a sudden I'm stalking you? I mean, come on, make that serious. Like, and like, and like and most of these losers, now let me say when I say losers, I don't have time to, divi uh, to uh, divide you guys up into black, white, brown, yellow, red losers. To me, all you guys are losers. So that's it. I don't, I don't have time for that. So that's all we're going about. These losers come back and they'll say, oh, you don't know what you're talking about. Or the order makes them, makes them like, they make a ridiculous ass point. Like, I'll, I'll use this example. I've had a video, it's probably up by now, I had a video where most deaf got deported. And the uh, argument some people were making was, well, you know that uh, that that picture on that uh, link, that's from his documentary. And I'm like, like, what, like really? I'm like, okay. And I, I'm like, I'm saying, okay, as in, okay, what else? You know, thinking they're going to go into the meat of the conversation. They were like, how do you know that picture is from... Him not being deported, him being not being in the country, allowed back in the country, and this is when I start. To, this is where I get mad because now I have to dumb down to your level, and I'm like, and I, I try to, I got at this, I got at this person. I didn't want to do it, but I had to do it because the stupidity just got me. I was just like, nah, we ain't playing this all day. So what I said is, how can a picture change his status? He's still not coming in the country. Whether you, whether he, that picture is right, wrong, or indifferent, that's not the point. And this is the problem you debate with some black people. They don't get it that it's not the point. Like a lot of them will say, like that's like, like, like they get mad at me. Some do. They say, well, we're moving back to Africa. I'm like, move back to Africa. I don't give a fuck. I ain't from that no Africa. I'm from born in Brooklyn. If I don't move my hometown, I'm moving back to Brooklyn. And they give me all that 
African garbage, you know how they, they give me the African garbage, and then I'm like, I see him a, a year later, well, why haven't you moved? Oh, you know, I know you I'm like, first of all, Ghana, and there's probably still some African countries who are willing to give you a place to lay your nappy headed ass down. You can take advantage of it, and now you got excuses. Or, or, or they make up some fucking outrageous ass excuse that you know is an obvious lie when they try to get away. Well, my cat was getting sued, and, and his wife was having kittens, and you know, she's having a, 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 a lung transplant, and I, I couldn't leave him at the vet for it. I'm like, shut up. And this is the problem I've received with you, with you guys. And, 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 and here's, the, here's another comment which I got, which from one of these skillet Africans, pan skillet Africans. And, the, and like, he was really trying to get in on me. He's trying to take a little shots at me. I said, look, man, you hear America so bad. Why aren't you an African? I mean, if I hated something that bad, I'd be doing my damage to get away or out of a situation. Well, I will when you buy me a ticket. Oh, well, why am I buying you a ticket? You ain't my kid. You ain't my, you ain't, you ain't some chick I'm trying to get rid of. I mean, why should I buy you a ticket? See, that's the mentality they have because they're so used to the government giving them shit that they don't want to aspire to be anything but shit. So all you losers out here, I'm trying, I mean, I'm doing a lot better with this. A lot of them are trying to bait me because they'll post something and they know, bam, I'll get on it. Like the, like the latest one was, uh, I had a post on my one group, I posted about uh, New Jersey is going to sign a law, in a law where, or it's up for a vote, being voted, where New Jersey is going to sign into law that's a, it's against the law to have sex with an animal. Uh, you know and I know that's sick, right? We all know this. But, like I try to explain to people, if you pass homosexuality, who are you now to set parameters on what is deemed as moral and immoral when you pass an immoral act according to your own God and your religious belief system? And that, that was my point. My point was, where's all the protests for these people? Where's all their support for them? Where's all their chapters for them? Where's all these people going to rallies and do this and do that? They didn't have any. And that was the point I was trying to make. I wasn't making the point where, hey, sleep with a sheep you want to. I personally think you should not sleep with a sheep. I mean, maybe that's just me. Maybe I'm built different. But, but these people will make asinine arguments, and you're like, they don't have nothing to do with what you're talking about. You're like, and that's why I don't really... I'll go to groups and I'll start chatting, but when I see that they start doing this dumb shit, I'm like, look, man, I fall back from a lot of posts. So, if you want me to get me to chat on your group, just don't post no stupid shit. Or, uh, well, I'll post. So, alright, I'm out. Peace.